I was curious if there's a difference between the dynamic between Dean, uh, Sam and Mary and Dean and Mary. Absolutely. Um, how to explain that is going to be difficult, but I think uh, for me, what's most exciting for me about playing Sam with Mary back in the picture is that I feel like we never really saw Sam be a son. We saw him with his dad, but he wasn't like, hey dad, you know, like it was like, fuck you dad. It was never, it was contentious. As soon as Sam could get out of the house, he got out of the house. He didn't want to be a part of his dad's life. He didn't want to get into the hunting life. He wanted out. He didn't do it, but he was like, you know what, I'm done with that. I'm done. Um, so now we see Sam with his mom, who he doesn't have any ill will towards, he never really knew. And Dean knew mom, albeit for four years or whatever it was, but he has memories of mom, he has pictures of mom, he remembers the sandwiches she used to make, blah, blah, blah. Uh, Sam doesn't know that, he just knows that this is his mother and he loves her, it's his mother, but he doesn't know her. And I think, I, I think Sam feels towards Mary the way Dean feels towards Sam. Like, Sam wants to keep Mary safe. Like, he lost Mary. He never really knew her. But I feel like, you know, Mary's a hunter. Um, but it, if they're going, if Sam and Dean are off on a hunt, mom's not going to be like, all right, guys, you know, call me when you get home. I'll have some Sam. She's going to want to hunt. She's a hunter. Um, but I feel like Sam's going to be like, no, no, no. no. I, like, uh, I don't want to, you know, even though he should trust her. I mean, she was a very uh, powerful hunter. How are you? How are you doing? I didn't even see you. <laughs> I'm hiding. Come on. How are you? Awesome. <laughs> so, my question is, Mary's a hunter, the boys are a hunter, but in big part of the boys are hunters because her deal with the LID, yeah. who she apologized for before we know why. Sure. Is this something that we, you think we will explore? I think so, yeah. Because the funny thing is, is Sam, like I was just saying, Sam blames dad for all the hunting stuff. But really, you could argue it was mom's fault. I mean, she was the hunter, right? Uh, it was the Campbell family, not the Winchester family. Um, and she kind of, it wasn't her fault, but it, it was her lineage that led us to where we are now. That having been said, I think the boys know that this is their life, and this is what they're good at. This is what this is the way they can best help the world. Um, and so I think they're, they're great. It's like a double-edged sword, but they're grateful that they're in this life because they can do it better than anybody else. Um, but I think we're gonna see Sam probably not want his mom to go out and hunt, you know? It's like, it's my mom, man. Like, I don't want to see her get punched or shot or bit by a vampire or something like that. <laughs> and I'm sure the same thing with Dean, though I think uh, there are a few little cute moments where, you know, Mary's like, well, I'm your mother. You gotta listen, you know? And you're like, well, it's kind of right. It's weird, but it's kind of right. Anybody, but those can you, kind of ones well, are talking about. Can you tell me what's going on with the mental letters? Well, they didn't start off on the right foot. Um, so the, the British Middle Letters is much more regimented and structured, obviously, than our version of the Middle Letters, even though we were never properly initiated. So I think they they know certain parts about the Winchesters that are true, but just look wrong on paper. Like, we started the apocalypse, you know? <laughs> we let Lucifer out of his cage. Looks bad on paper, and the, and the Brits aren't happy about it. Um, but I, I hope we can come to an understanding. Uh, 